Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel with another informative and useful video. So guys, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix AirDrop not working issue on iPhone after iOS 18 beta update. So guys, if you are facing this problem and you don't know that, how can you fix this issue? So guys, in this video, I'll show you how can you fix it. So let's start our video without wasting any time. So guys, our first step is to check airdrop is enabled so guys for that you have to just simply drag down your control center and tap on airdrop and tap on again and make sure that the airdrop is enabled so guys after this you have to make sure that your wi-fi and bluetooth is also enabled if it is enabled then try disable it and after that again enable bluetooth and wi-fi and check if the problem is fixed or not if the problem is still there guys then you have to just simply open settings here tap on journal scroll down and then tap on shutdown so guys simply restart your iphone to 15 to 20 seconds and after that open your device and check if the problem is fixed or not and if the problem is still there guys then you have to just simply check for the restrictions for that you have to just simply open again settings scroll down and then tap on sorry scroll down and here the tap on screen time scroll down and then tap on content and privacy restriction and after this turn it on and simply tap on here allowed apps and you have to make sure that the airdrop is enabled if it is disabled then simply enable it and check if the problem is fixed or not if the problem is still there guys then you have to make sure that the personal hotspot is turned off if it is turned on then simply turn it off and check if the problem is fixed or not and after trying all of these steps and you are still facing the issue then i will suggest you to do reset your network settings so guys for that you have to just simply open settings scroll down and then tap on journal scroll down and here the tap on transfer or reset iphone tap on reset tap your reset network settings enter your iphone password and reset your network setting for one time so guys after this hopefully your problem will be fixed so that's it for today guys hope this video helps you if the video helps you then please subscribe to my channel thank you